In the diagram below, right triangle PQR is transformed by a sequence of rigid motions that maps it onto right triangle NML. Write a set of three congruency statements that would show ASA congruency for these triangles. Okay, so the... Uh, Right triangle PQR is transformed by a sequence of rigid motions that maps it onto NML. So immediately you can see that PQR and NML, all the corresponding um, angles there, right? P corresponds with N, Q corresponds with M, R corresponds with L. So these angles are going to be congruent. So it says here, write a set of three congruency statements that would show ASA. So I've just demonstrated the two angles already, right? So I know that angle P will be congruent to angle N. And I also know that um, RP is congruent to NL. Sorry, LN, I should say. And I also know that angle R is congruent to angle L. So this would be angle side angle. And that's all they're really looking for. Uh, is this the only way that you can write this? No, this is one way that you can do this. You can also do others, right? You can list out others. You can say angle P, or actually angle Q, is congruent to angle M, because they're both right angles, right? And um, you can say angle, not angle, you can then say QP, is congruent to MN and you can also say that uh, angle P is congruent to angle R I'm sorry angle P is congruent to angle N these are other variations right so this is version 1 this is version 2 you have many different ways of writing this okay actually I should not say answer version I should say answer Answer one, answer two. Uh, there are three different possible ways that we can do this. Should I write out the last one? Sure, let's do that. So I can also say that angle Q is congruent to angle M. Uh, and QR is congruent to ML and angle R is congruent to angle L. This is answer three. Any of these would have been sufficient answers to show ASA.